Researchers at Utah State University are growing medical cannabis in an effort to better understand how to best prescribe it. This comes as part of a new state initiative announced today. New specialist Mike Anderson has a look at how it will all work. Inside this closely controlled greenhouse. So this is our collection of mother plants. Dr. Bruce Bugby and his team are growing and cloning cannabis plants. One of the, the, the key things we're looking at is optimizing production so the cost of production comes down. Something they've been doing over the past five years, supported by Utah cannabis farmers, helping them figure out the best conditions for cultivating the plant. Now they're getting the backing of the state to serve another purpose, working along with University of Utah Health. Our job is grow high quality pharmaceutical grade cannabis and their job is testing it for, with patients and getting the doses right, figuring out when it works, when it doesn't work. The new partnership and initiative is being called the Center for Medical Cannabis Research. Graduate students like Mitchell Westmoreland helping to better understand what's still a very new medical resource. It's been really interesting to see the evolution of how the state and the public has sort of changed their perception of cannabis. It's something several states like Utah are taking on because federal funding won't support it yet, as medical cannabis is only legal under individual state laws. One of the few states getting ahead of the curve for medical cannabis research. Bugby says this is very important in better understanding how medical cannabis interacts with other drugs and medical conditions, something that not a whole lot is known about so far. So we want to make sure we're not prescribing it for people that might have serious interactions with some other drug. Something he believes will be essential in learning how to use both CBD and THC safely. It's incredibly exciting to be a part of. Mike Anderson, KSL 5 News.